I keep beep beep ba boop boos. I feel like playing deliriums. Yeah, we're gonna play black. Black. Blah deliriums, and we're gonna play bleep black deliriums. This is mono green because everyone likes the shits. Alright, beep bat boots, we've got the ramper blimps, we've got the sleeper jimps. Uh, crop sigil or the vessel? I think crop sigil because I've got three two drops, so I don't want to waste a turn sacra blap in my chapa blaps. So probably death cap next because it's highly unlikely this is going to be a 3 4 on turn 3. Ooh, he's doing the end step evolving wilds. He's such a smarty. He's such a smarties. Alright, that's good, I think. Having that guy in the bin. All right, now if I play this, then next turn I can do a shit on that ball. So I'm I'm gonna play this. There's a there's a mild chance I'll stick for two other types in the bin. A mild chance. Is it gonna be blue or red? Is he playing blue red McGee? Bubble 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 bubble. Ah, oh, what? That's the second time in a row. Somebody's trying to make me look like a fool. Whoa! White humans and he's doing end step McGee bullshits. What a bloody bell end. Alright, hold your spaghetti. Are we gonna have a 3 4? 3 4 on turn 3. Could be. So we've got an enchantment and a creature. I need a land and an artifact. All right, a land, that's it. <laughs> couldn't do it. We couldn't do it, ladies and jeeps. The, yes, this is the end of Majiks. <laughs> this is the end of the world. Ah, so close. Not really, but you know. So what's the plan? I think play two death cap shits. As opposed to an inexorable blob. An inexorable bloob. Oh man. More lands. This is the shit. Alright, uh, that comes into play tapped. So I can't even do two things. What a fucking disaster. What are these olsters? Talia can upset a game like no other fucking bitch except Gabby Sparts. <laughs> Oh, Gabby. Gabby! What have you done, Gabs? So, he attacks with both. This becomes a 4-3. I'll block here. He might have a Pompedos to kill this, but that's not the end. That's not the end of the Spagheets. I really need this to be a 3-4. Yeah, probably still not still not enough. Ah, the old humans of shitness. <laughs> so, can I draw any removage? Probably not. Alright, finally triggered this bollocks at least. I lost my fucking nature's way. Needed that more than I needed your mum to sit on my willy. Uh, I'm just gonna get fucking rampaged anyway. What can I do? What can I do? Yes. I feel like even these kind of decks need to be modified to be creme de la beans. So maybe the three mana Nissa, even though it doesn't have delirium and there's no need. I mean, I'm just going to get blapped. Actually, that's an exaggeration. This deck plays out nicely a lot of the time, and it's fun. Which is half the point of playing Majiks. So let's think. Three death touch. Uh, this guy's still going to come into play tapped. Well, I got like a one 
in 35 chance of drawing another nature's way for this. I'm sure I'll do it. Super likely, don't you think? Don't you think? Oh, I got the the Pompidos too. I forgot about Pompidos. Yeah, still more of the same fucking unusable twat. <sighs> one target land and one creature. I suppose I could put this back eventually, but it won't do anything. Has he got Avacyn? Gonna flashbang the Avacyn because every, every nothing says human like a flash angel. <laughs> Although technically, you know, Avacyn does protect humans. So it's super flavorful if you want to get serious about the law. Mm. There's nothing about this bullshit. Why don't I play my flying angel cunt bollock? Alright, I don't know what I could draw. I don't know what I could do to avoid losing. So, a couple of attacks with... Gisela, um, I'm deed. It's not been the worst fight back of all time. I mean, I don't have it's mono green. So you're not supposed to be on the defense, really. Yeah, that's all it takes. Even if this was a 1-1, uh, what can I what can I do? Oh, Ishkanar, I suppose, exists. But they'll all come into play tapped, so I have to draw it right this second. No. Oh well. That's life. I still think that deck is pretty fun. But let's try the black version. I think I still have it. No, I don't. Maybe I don't. Ah, here it is. See, if I was playing this, maybe this is the better version because it kills everybody. I wouldn't have lost that game. Well, that's not true. I might have lost, but I wouldn't have lost because I'm sitting there with my dick in my hand going, I can't kill nothing. I can't kill nothing, son. He's just going to botch me in the face. He can't fly. Alright, we're playing Whatabups 21.99. Sounds like a knob. Alright, we've got the mono blacks. We've got this guy. Look at this for some sex moms. I haven't looked at this deck in a long time, so there's probably quite a few cards I should put in. Fatal push. Oh, is it the planies? Is he busting planies? If he is, he can suck a cock. Mm, well, can't tell at the moment. Because this, I like this card. It could go literally anywhere. But... Oaths are almost exclusively the domain of the twatty Planeswalker player. I got one blow up of Planes, I suppose. But going second and playing Planeswalkers means I'm just not playing. To the amount of times you fought your balls off against Planeswalkers and got to like, they're out of cards, you're just about to do a shit. And they'll just play Chandra 
and wipe your board, and then next turn they'll play Omnixilus to draw some shit, and you just think, fuck off. Fuck this game up the ass forever. All right. Mono green. I don't think the three mana planies is in mono green because we all know you have to play all your planies. So I presume. Ooh, I don't know if I have the new Liliana in this. That is proper del deliriums. So three colors. No forests. I'm not sure what this deck is. It looks like the planes. I'm playing this. If it gets countered, these things happen. Mm, I hate it when I am playing against Planeswalkers and I'm just not putting them under any pressure on up until turn 5 or some balls. Mine Rack Demon could be alright. If they don't have an answer. Still, playing Planeswalkers is just like the ultimate unsatisfying thing. Even playing Mill is a little bit more like... I've got, yeah, fucking Planeswalker cunts. Planeswalker cunts all day long. So, do I plus this or minus it? It is all about reanimate. Sort of, well, it's not all about reanimate. Alright. All right. I'll play this first, because you never know what will end up in the bin. Fucking, fucking balls. So, what Planeswalker is he going to bust out? Is it going to be Omnixilus? Jace? So, up to turn four, two damage. That's literally the opposite of what you need to be doing against the cunt. Yeah, so there's just no way that it ain't planies. If you plays LARP all the peeps or any other version of that cunty shit. Prism Array? What is this balls? That's a tap at it. Tap target creature, yeah. Hmm. Well, I haven't triggered delirium, so I'm taking damage. I think I might have to minus this now. Oh, fuck. I need a creature to be in the grave. I realize I'm obviously running into blow up all the peeps, but if you can't, you can't play the long game against planees, obviously, you're going to get planeed. Plus, lost mine, naturally. So what do we got? Two Fatal Push, two Instants, a Planeswalker, and a Land. We got more Planeswalkers than Creatures. Super normals. Ulamog shouldn't be in here, by the way. It's only in here because I thought it'd be fun to pull it out of the grave, but it never is because it just gets bounced or exiled. So I should really just play three Gaia's Revenge, or two Gaia's Revenge, and three... What do you call it? The big plated crusher. Mm. Alright, I'm going to give the guy to here because he's already playing the shittest cunt bollock deck there is. And if he doesn't know how to use it, he can suck a fucking spaghetti Dijonais. Alright, you're a fucking twat. Get out of my game. You fucking little dick prick of shit. 
Why do I always play cunts? I don't understand. <sighs> Bell bags. Well, I got creatures in the grave now. <laughs> hmm. Still, it's going to be tough. I might actually get to cast Ulamog if the game goes long enough. Who can say? Ah! Ah! Who can say? He can say, obviously. He's got fucking Chandra. This is why this game can eat shit. I can't give up two creatures for my Liliana, so Lily's got to be dead. That was an odd choice. Where is the AI? All right. No point playing any more creatures, I don't think. Probably just got another blow up all the peeps. What's yeah, that's a four three. So yeah, if he's got radiant flames or blow up the peeps, they'll die anyway. <sighs> Good old AI. Don't blow this up. Don't blow up your useless prism array. Blow up the thing that lets you cast all your multicolored planies for free. Well, not for free, but you know, colorless versions. What is the point of being alive? <laughs> I had more planies than him. Fuck you, you twat. Prism array. Eat shit, you stupid asshole. Alright, hopefully we'll play someone who's not a bell bags. Also, what else can go in this deck? I think this is still going in. Because it's good. What do we got? Three of these, that's fine. Two of these. Yeah, that's probably fine. Two of these, good. good. Three of these, yep. Ba -ba -da -ba, yep. Ba -ba. Uh, I don't know if I need to gather the packs. Alright. That's potential to get a kick in the balls. Ah, oh, look at the planies, the planies, the squeebeebs. Alright, it's looking pretty good. I don't want an Ulamog. Uh, oh, I was already at 61. Uh, I honestly don't like this very much. But it's uh, where else are you playing it? And the very least I can do is try and be flavorful. Am I sticking a Nissa in for no reason? Yeah, it's just so fucking ridiculous. Why would I play this over a Nissa?
Hmm. I never get to use this one. It's pretty good. Yeah, let's fucking try it. I never get to play with this. Alright, get out of the pack, eat shit. So it took two, three drops out. Two, two drops out for two, three drops. I don't know if that's bad, Majik's building, but you know that that's not my forte. My forte is blaming everyone else except me for why I lose. Man, the connection is not great today. Oh, there we go. We got a game. So I want to play Lily Bay. I want an ultimate Lily Boy's creature, Planeswalker. That's the plan for today. GP London tomorrow. GP London tomorrow, ladies and jeeps. It's probably finished from wherever you are, but if you've somehow got a time machine, come over and so say, say hello to me. You don't know what I look like, so but I'll be shouting probably. So you oh have a bacon sandwich, you fucking shit! Fuck you! What a three hands with one mana and then all mana. You go fuck your dad, you piece of shit. You know what? I'm going to go to the GP. I'm just going to shit on every single table because of that. Because of that mulligan rule, I'm just going to eat two kebabs before I get there. I'm just going to wipe my ass on everyone's deck box. And if they go, what are we doing? What are you doing? You're wiping your ass. Then what will I do? I don't know. Probably take my shoe and then just put them on my hands and run around like I'm a dog. And then everyone will think, uh-oh, he's a fucking loony. And then I'll get it away with it. Totally scot-free. Fuck me! What is this bullshit? What was that? 16 hands in a row where it was just unplayable dog's ass. Magic needs to shit on its own knob. Well, alright, I'm playing this first because this is just ripe for getting blapped. Mm, you gotta play your planies. Man, I do like this deck. I like Majiks. I just wish it was better. And I will. It's just. <laughs> I, I wish that M14 was transferable from Xbox to Steam. And I just play that instead. Alright, that's not what I want in my hand. That's a, a Don't Years. That's a Don't Years, ladies and jeeps. Shouldn't really be playing that. But if he's got a haste creature, it's the ultimate blocks. How has my hand gone from looking super spiced to turbo shit? Alright, that's pretty good. It's pretty good. Fatal push. It took a long time for the fatal switched music to really make me see the light. It's because all my decks I like. I like big big top beats. Big top beats equals schmeek top schmeeps. If he's trading a, a Pompedos for that, fine. Whatevs. <laughs> I'm sure I'll draw something good within five turns. You gotta believe it. You gotta believe it. You gotta believe it. Ah, <sighs> so it's one land hand, five land hands out of five, because you've already mulliganed twice. Draw no land hands. Those are our options. What's underneath? Yeah, he just gets the lands whenever he needs. Bust those lands. Am I going to have to waste premium planies buster on a 2-1? I bet you I do. I bet you I do, son. <sighs> right, so he's out of Pompedos. Or maybe he just doesn't need to shit on it. I 
don't think he's going to have a Chandra. Although, if he does, I'll look stupid. And at the very least, I can put a 2-2 two -two on the field next turn if I don't draw anything good. Oh, man! Should have concentrated a bit more. We got all the Deliriums. Could have attacked. Could have attacked for three. Now he's playing the Dragoons. Ah, oh, bollocks. Bollock bop bops. Alright, none of this is too bad. One mana. Nissa should be... It's not, I wouldn't say enough, but it should be a good start. At the very least, it'll drain... Six damage from a mono red deck. Oh, fucking hell. Well, I can't complain. I mean, I built it like this. Hmm. <laughs> Let's think. Okay, so the plan still stands. Nis bags next, and then fuck around. If he ever plays something big, noxious gear bangs. All right, Nis will actually get killed, which is unfortunate. Two, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, so Nis will die. <laughs> Maybe I just play Gear Hulk and kill one of these things. Yeah, I mean, he's only got one card left. And Nissa is too good to just be spunking. Maybe I should. Yeah. Maybe I should have targeted this. At the very worst, he would have sacrificed it in response. We'll seize. If I get to play this, then it's, you've got to imagine it's all over. You got it, Sam. Mm-hmm. All right, that has gone swimmingly. So I'm playing this regardless if I draw another land. All right, I didn't, so eat my spaghettes. That looks like a pretty primitive mono red deck, really. But you always gotta watch out for him. What's the rank? That's pretty high. Maybe it's just his version and he's got some other spaghetti deeps. Now, what is the play? I think Plated Crusher is still better than attacking for five next turn. So what I'll do, if I don't draw a manual land, I'll do the old double taps and play play Crusher. Got some serious thinking with his one man ace. Alright, he must be thinking the only chance of winning is damage. I don't think that's true. The best that could be is what? I already exiled it. This thing. What do you got? What do you got? 
do one, two, three, four, maybe. Maybe that was it, Ravaging Blaze or whatever that card is called. <laughs> so what do you think is the smarter play? To leave this back forever, because he's not ever attacking through it, and attack with these? Nah, not now. Maybe I should have played Sinister Concoction. I wouldn't have been able to do anything. <laughs> That's why I play this dude. You're not catching me with that fucking common dog's bollocks trick. I don't know what this could be, so I'm blocking here. Just to be safe. <laughs> what are you doing that for, you bellend? <laughs> oh, well, yeah, let me just give three extra damage to nobody. Because that's, that's how you want to do it. Uh, technically, I'm wasting time by doing that. Uh, still got all these. Still got all these! We still got all these dim. From the graveyard to the battlefield. Yeah, smash him! Smash his 1-1! One, one. Man, mono green delirium looks quite weak in comparison to all of this shit. Alright, one more game with this version, I think. Shall I? Or shall I call it a day? Eh, I sort of need to do some work. So bollocks. If you like the decks, yeah, put it in the comments if you like it, so I know that I should play them again a bit more frequently. Alright, Squeebles, my chicken McSqueebles. <laughs> 